I don't know. So let's, uh, let's go and determine how we're going to find the area of a circle. Um, if we know the area, I'm sorry, we know the area of a circle is 132.7 square centimeters, and we want to find the diameter. Now, I told you guys from the start, if you get stuck with this, at least for anything, you don't know what to do, at least draw a picture of a circle, and then draw the formula, or write out the formula for area of a circle. That's the minimal. All right, and we have to know those formulas, and we have to know what a circle looks like. Now, remember when we talked about the characteristics of a circle, we said the circle has a center, and has a distance from the center to the outside is the radius, and the distance across a whole circle is what we call d, the diameter. And that's what we're looking for, right? So we actually need to create another formula for this, which would be how does d relate to r? So therefore, I asked Megan, how does d relate to r? How is D related to R? R is half the size of D. R is half the, si half the size of D. Or I could also say diameter equals 2R, right? You could also say 1 half D is R, right? But you could, you could say D is 2R, correct? Either way, whatever you said was correct as well. I'm just writing it that way, all right? So now we take the information that we're provided and plug it into our formula. We know what the area is, 132.7 equals pi R squared. They're asking us to find the diameter. However, to find the diameter, I need to find r. Well, that is my only variable left. Pi is, again, a number in our calculator. So what I'm going to do is now I'm going to solve for r. So to do that, I'm going to divide by pi. All right, But I'm not just going to divide yet. I'm going to do all these operations together. Therefore, I have 132.7 divided by pi equals r squared. I need to solve for r, not r squared. So to do that, I need to take the square root of both sides. Therefore, r equals, and this is what I type in my calculator, 132.7 divided by the symbol pi in my calculator. Do not approximate using 3.14 unless told to do so. And I get 42.2397219. And then I take the square root of that answer. And I get rounded to the 10th is 6.5. Now, to find my diameter, I plug in my value of r into this equation. d equals 2 times 6.5. d equals 13. Okay. So if you got that answer, give yourself an m. If you only found the radius, but